What's happening with my hair? It's expressing okay. itself. <laughs> and you're watching Style Files. I mean, when I was a kid, our parents played really cool music. I remember finding out about Janis Joplin for the first time. She blew my mind, like, just hearing her voice and stuff. I remember the Spice Girls just having such a massive impact on me and, like, just becoming completely obsessed with them. Like, I was ginger, so obviously I loved, like, ginger spice. I mean, I had kind of a unique shade of red, I think, my original hair colour, and everyone would always sort of compliment it. But there has been eras, because I think it was, at first, it was like just red and long, and then I like cut my hair into a bob, which was like sort of wanting a new look again, and now it's like totally different colours. And then style-wise, I think it's easier to dress if you like pick a character. Sometimes if I'm like trying to just dress myself, I'm like, oh, I don't know what to wear. And then if I like think, oh, I want to look like one of the chicks from Ghost World or like Clueless or something. It's, it's way easier to pick a someone else and try and dress like them. I have a ponytail in it. I'm like, oh my God, pony. I basically wanted to be third degree burns from the Fabulous Stains movie. And I watched like this scene every day where, it's <laughs> really mental, isn't it? I'm like, <laughs> I watched this scene where I play a show Everyone's like, oh, girls can't do rock and roll. And then she like screams at the audience. And she has like two blonde streaks and black hair. So she was my hair inspiration. Getting my hair done and figuring out what, what I'm going to wear is a really big part of going on stage. Changing your hair is really good if you like need a new identity or you've like gone through a tough time. One of my close friends died last year. It changed everything about how I, you know, thought about life. It's almost like you've got nothing to lose in a way. You can just take more risks. Now, I'm not really worried if people say anything mean about me. I'm worried about like, what effect that would have on like, my fans. That's the whole point for me of writing songs and playing shows, is to like, communicate with people. I love like, looking them in the eye and seeing them and meeting them after and stuff. Oh, thank you so much. You're so sweet. <laughs> if I have a good gig, I feel like everything just like meets and connects. When that happens, it's like the biggest release. Like, it's better than anything. It's my favourite thing to do. Yeah.